hello friends in this video let's see how to deploy an application in on premise okay so in order to deploy a mule application in on premise we need to have a mule standalone okay so mule standalone is something which helps us to run our mule apps you know it is we need to uh, install that in on premise and that should help us to run our mule apps so first let's see uh, where we can download the mule standalone time in mule standalone is a mule runtime engine which runs our mule apps okay so open your browser and search for mule standalone so once you search mule standalone download open the first link So here you should provide your details, okay? Um, here select Mule Standalone and select the server latest and give your first name, last name, email ID, company, your title, you know, and click this checkbox and click download, okay? And your Mule Standalone server will get downloaded. Once you download the mule standalone it will download as a zip format okay let me show you that so i have already downloaded a mule standalone so you can see it is in the form of zip so we have to extract this file okay we have to extract this file and that's it we have to do nothing else just extract this to the location where you want to have your standalone okay so click extract all so i am going to extract my mule standalone into this particular location click extract and that will be going to get extracted and then your mule server is ready to use so once you extract your mule standalone now open that file and there you should be able to see files something like this here the apps folder contains your applications which you have which you have deployed into your on-premise server okay and uh, here in logs you should be able to see all your application logs and policies you should be able to see what are all the policies that you have applied for your uh, different different applications okay so now let's uh, you know link this mule standalone server with our anypan platform okay in order to do that let's open anypan platform Okay, log into your Anypan platform account and then um, move to your runtime manager. Here, in runtime manager, you have to select servers. Okay. And here, click on add server. Here, give the name. and copy the command now let's open the file manager where we have extracted our mule standalone and here opens command prompt now uh, move to bin folder and here paste the um, command that you just copied and remove dot slash and click so you can see that mule agent configured successfully right let's now navigate to any point platform so here you can see server on prem got created okay but it is not it running so we need to run this so we need to run our mule server now let's open the command prompt again 
to start the mule server type mule space dot bat and click enter Now you can see our mule runtime got deployed, right? So our mule runtime got deployed. Then now let's go into, now let's navigate to any point platform, right? Here you can see our mule runtime is now running. Now we can deploy our applications. So click on applications. Here click deploy. And let's give a name to our app that we want to deploy. And here select the target deployment target as hybrid. And here you need to select the server name. Okay. And let's choose our jar file that we wanted to deploy. So let me select the jar file, click open and click deploy my application is getting started now um let's see something okay so here we are running our mule app right so if i close this command prompt our mule standalone will get disconnected with the inbound platform let me show you let's go into the source you can see our server got disconnected right so so we don't want to have this right you know, if we can't keep a common prompt running always. So in order to avoid that, what we can do is um, just open common prompt again. Common prompt, just open the common prompt again from the same location where we have um, extracted all, where we have extracted our mule server. Right. So here again, move to bin folder and uh, let's type mule space dot bat install. Okay. This, what this one will do is this will um, run our mule server as a Windows service. So once you Type mule dot bat space install. Um, you will get to see mule interface edition service got installed. Okay. Now type mule start. So now here you can see mule enterprise edition service has started right so let's go ahead and see check in platform so here you can see that app got started right now uh, now let's try closing this command prompt and check if our server goes down or still stays up okay i closed my command prompt let's now try to refresh this page Yeah, still you can see that app is showing up.